We've been playing like that a lot since the second half of the season, but we've been going to him a lot more, you know, making more of a presence on the inside. And he's doing it on both ends of the court. You know, you know, he really is inspiring to, to the teammates when he's got it going like that. On both ends of the court, we kind of feed off his energy. Talk about the big Yeah, they were big in that fourth quarter stretch. You know, with starters, a lot of the starters on the bench, Keon. Uh, you know, Utah came out and kind of raced the lead right away, but then they we settled down. Those guys hit some big shot, pushed the lead uh, until the starters got back in. It really made it easy on us for us to close the game once we got back in the game. Paul, what has impressed you the most about Avery's development to be you know trusted with big time minutes in a close game right now? Just his confidence. You know, that's all it's been pretty much with him. You know, just getting the experience, getting the confidence. You know, we know uh, his ability. You know, he shows it when we're able to practice. Uh, you know, uh, like I said before, it's so just about getting that in-game experience, and he's gaining more and more confidence. You know, he's comfortable out there. He's understand what Docs want from him, and uh, he's looking good, man. You talked a lot about you know getting to the point with the crunch time points. The season, obviously, you guys playing much better after the All Star game. How much you guys? You know, you pull into a tie with Philadelphia. How much do you guys know, you know, Philadelphia pulls a half game ahead? We got to try to match that the next day. Well, I, I know everything. You know, I, I keep up with this stuff religiously. <laughs> you know, I'm constantly always on ESPN.com, NBA.com, all the, all the websites. I'm always checking the scores, even in the middle of the game, checking out who's winning. Pretty much all the scores from tonight. I mean, you know, I'm just a basketball junkie. You know, I just. Something I live, and I'm sure the other guys, they pretty much probably do the same things I do very well.